Happy Monday, grade three, four. I hope you had a marvelous weekend. I had a great weekend. And this Monday morning, you know what? I want to start it off with a class discussion. Remember how when we were in the classroom from time to time, we'd have some class discussions. And I think now is a great time to have another class discussion. I don't know if you've been following along or talking in your household or with your parents or guardians about what's been happening in the news, but it's something that I've been thinking about a lot lately. And I think as a class, we can do something to help make the world a better place. So what I mean when I'm talking about what's happening in the news, I'm referring to in the Maritimes, um, the guy who just decided to go randomly make a list and killing, it's gruesome, it's brutal. If you haven't heard of it, um, you can find it on the news, talk to your parents about it. Um, I'm also talking about um, down in the States too, and there's a whole bunch of controversial things about this online everywhere. Um, George Floyd, does that ring a bell? If not, look it up with your family members, your parents, your guardian, have a discussion about it. Um, there's a lot going on online. There's people who are protesting Black Lives Matter, and there's people who are protesting All Lives Matter. We're starting to get into fights over all of these different things that we're saying. And none of it is right. And I think the best way we can overcome this is simply to be kind. Grade three, four. It matters so, so much to be kind, to just be kind. There's gonna be differences in people. There's gonna be similarities in people. But you know what? You need to treat others with kindness. And right now in this world, there is more hate than there is kindness. And I think it is our job, it is our responsibility as a grade three, four class to show the world that, you know what? We can be kind. Bad things can happen and we can be kind. There can be different people all around the world with different beliefs and different wants and different ways of living. But you know what? We can be kind. That is the biggest thing you can do. You can be respectful towards differences. You can acknowledge differences and their uniqueness. Remember in the classroom how we went around and discovered how we are different and how that's cool? and how boring it would be if we were all the same, and how some similarities we have with others link us together. That's an exciting part. And there's gonna be people in this world that we get along with and we really, really like. And you know what? There's gonna be people in this world who you might not like, and that's okay. But you still have to be respectful, and you still have to be kind, no matter what and to whom, whether it's black, whether it's white, whether it's indigenous people, it does not matter. You need to be kind and respectful. So my challenge for you today, grade three, four, is to be kind. And you know what? There's a million and one ways you can do this. Playgrounds are now opened, yay! Be kind on the playground, say kind things walk away if you don't have anything good to say. If you notice someone down in the dumps, give them a smile. There's a million ways to be kind. And I want you to find one out of the million. And I want you to practice it. So my challenge, do something kind today. Something that is going to make someone else smile or feel good or happy. That is my challenge for you today, grade three, four. Be kind. It is so important now. It really is. And I know you can do it because I have a fabulous class full of 
fabulous students who I miss terribly. But one thing I know about my grade three, four students is they can certainly be kind. So go spread a little kindness, grade three, four, and I'll see you later.